Hallelujah. Shake hands with five people and tell them this is your day. Shake hands with five people and just tell them this is your day. Shake those hands with them. Shake those hands with them. Hallelujah. Amen. As we gather, may your spirit work within us. As we Take your seat. Amen. Praise the Lord. Um, hallelujah. I want to. I want to say a few things this morning and I may not go down well to say some things you may want to hear or some things that Christians want to hear. There are some things I will say that when I say them, you listen. When I just drop them, you wait. Don't, don't crucify me and don't judge me or don't see me like a sinner. You wait. Let me explain um, what I mean. Amen. I want to talk on relationship the right way. Relationship the right way. Amen. Somebody say relationship the right way. Say that again. Say relationship the right way. Now in church, I've seen some churches where they, when you walk into that church, you see brothers sitting somewhere, sisters somewhere. They must not mix. It is a law so that they do not sin. Is that true? Such churches have more sins. You know why? Because they feel that you must not relate with the opposite sex. That if you do that, there'll be a problem. And that is good, but it's not a full truth. And you must understand that half truth is more dangerous than a lie. Half truth is more dangerous than a lie. Now, I have four daughters. I will not flog my daughter if I see them with boys. No way. But I can only tell them a no-go area they must have in their mind. Because if I stop them, the human nature is inquisitive. They want to know why that is stopping them. So what I need to do is to draw them into their head what they must, they must never do. No matter the gun or the sweet words a guy uses, I must say, this part, don't go. 
you can be friends hello let them learn and understand a few things they will see reasons why they will control themselves but when that is guiding them because you are saying don't talk with the brother don't talk with this don't talk with that don't talk with that it's not possible you you control that at home you can't control that in school they will go to school no school is far church yes i'm their father i'm their father but there are some bad guys in church with apostle picking oh yeah they want to put her will i be there am i saying the truth will i be there Am I going to marry them? I'm not in that. Somebody said to me, saw my daughter, I said, they're very fine. You go back gone. I said, me. <laughs> I reject it. <laughs> back gone for them. I said, I won't do that. But there are some truths. And I've started teaching them. There are some things they'll see on TV. They say, mm. Sometimes I deliberately turn to some things to see their reaction. I'll just put on some, some is it African magic they call it? African magic, just come. You're walking. Oh, daddy, let's watch Nicolidion. I say, okay. They have no, their interest. Are you following what I'm talking about? So I'm working on that. When I work on that, I'm fine. We live in a very corrupt world. You can't tell somebody, don't, don't. When that guides her or guides him, leave them. Hello? That's the truth. So that, those are the part of things I want to share with us. You can have, okay. You can date without courtship. But you cannot have courtship without dating. Let me explain. It's not everybody you meet that is your female friend or your male friend that you must marry. It's not possible. Ah, but what we help that courtship is let it be sexless. Am I making sense? You can choose to know yourself, be good friends, have a good relationship. Now, now, there is a level you are a friend to somebody of an opposite sex and it has gone beyond friendship. Both of you know it's just my friend why you wake up in the morning are you, are you okay are you up Say, are you fine where are you going today you are not just friends now yeah you know you are not just do you call all your friends like that eh? why are you calling that one special you know you are not just friends that's the truth it is not wrong it can it can be permitted you can see somebody you just like an opposite sex you like the person are you following what I'm talking about why are you looking at me like that Look at pretenders. I'm telling you the truth. Shut up. I'm telling you the truth. I want to talk to you so that you don't let, you don't, you, your, your mentality about life will be correct. Now, people can, you can see, come Madison, come. You can, I can see, I'm not, sorry. For example, it's a sister. I'm not saying a particular sister because I don't trust some of you. Say, so why did Papa pick that one? <laughs> For example, this is a sister. And I see, maybe I just, there are people you just have a connection to. It's not chemistry. Oh. Don't use that word chemistry. That word has been abused today. You just, have a, you just like the person. It is not wrong. Because obviously somebody just like you. Say, How can I be liking boy? God forbid. I... What is wrong is when you, your flesh begins to desire the person. Do you understand the difference? That's why I say there are some things I will tell you that church won't tell you. Once you like the sister, fire is a sin. And some of us are now badly. We don't know how to draw the line. So at the end of the day, we have so many of us struggling with immoral problems, deceiving ourselves, not because the devil is powerful, but because understanding is a problem. So I can see this my opposite sex, and I just like, mm, brother, why were you not in church? Okay, all right. You know, when Christians like themselves, it starts with weekly activities. You were not in. You didn't come to choir practice. Hey, ah, uh -uh. no wonder I was looking around the rehearsal, I didn't see you. That's where they start, you know. So, go and sit down. <laughs> so, what becomes wrong? It's when you now discover you're having strange feelings, you are desiring the person. That's why you say, no, 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 no. You have to bring in the word of God to check you. The Father, my body, my soul, my spirit is in line with God's word. So what I'm trying to explain to us is there's nothing wrong in that when people begin to like themselves. Whether you like it or not, when you now start liking somebody, like it or leave it, dating has started. Yes. That's the person you must call among others. 
That's the person you for you. I've not heard from you throughout today. Is it the Holy Spirit? That you miss not hearing from you? It has started already. But it's not necessary that that kind of person you like like that, you must marry. Are you following me? What is dating? Dating is, is, is when two people like themselves and they are connected and might even have a relationship. But, please, a no-go area is it must be what? Sexless. Totally. But when it's courtship, it's when two people date themselves with the intention of getting married. That is why I am I able to draw? You know, there are people that said, Papa, no, 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 no. I know, I know somebody told me, said, Papa, I want, you know you are very, you are a very real person. I said, yes, I want to ask you a question one-on-one. On one. I said, ask me. She said, young girl. She's from um, Unimen. He said, Papa, I had a sister who never touched a man before they got married. He said, and he didn't know that this man is not a man. I said, man is not a man. What do you mean man is not a man? That is, you know now, he's not a man. As well as me, he's not a man. You know, they try. I said, how oh, do you know they try? I said, oh, 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 it's not. He said, yeah. See, my sister now, she's crying. She can't go outside. So you have to, Papa, you know, you have to first test to check if he's a man. I said, no. He now said, there are some, they'll tell the girl, they'll say, um, if you can't be pregnant, for me to know, no, it's wrong. You can know a man without bed. You can know a lady who is fruitful without any lady that has a regular, effective menstrual flow is productive. Very productive. If anything now happens that she doesn't have a child, it's the devil. Medically, they'll tell you. All of those who once in a while they expect it this time, it doesn't come this time, it comes another time, it comes, it's not solid, it comes, it hangs. Those are the ones that need to start asking themselves, Father, something is wrong somewhere. I don't know if you are getting my point. Eh? The people they are spending on the 26, when they come 27. Some people, they are, they are menstrual flow change like political parties. Go, go. Like, <laughs> okay, then you can ask there's a problem. But apart from that, because the devil, the de you can't eat your cake and have it. The devil will never show you the paths where you're going to fall into trouble. The devil, I, I, I told, I, I, I was talking about um, sexual lies. The time I talked about sexual, right? I said there are certain sexual lies that the devil tells people. People that believe, number one, that sex makes a relationship stronger. That's the number one sexual lies. They say sex makes a relationship stronger. Lie. Sex in the relationship brings suspicion, a lot of suspicion. It is their heart that falls in love, not the body. Your heart. Once you get into, uh, the best thing you can do for yourself is when you have a relationship with somebody you're going to get married to, never sleep with the person. In fact, it's the best thing you can do for your life. Because when that is involved, a lot of nonsense. You become unnecessarily possessive. You become unnecessarily jealous. You start feeling like you owe the person the debt. I don't, I don't know if you have fallen. I'm talking about you unnecessary, many unnecessary things. You start coming, you see somebody talking to him uh -huh, uh -huh, because you are feeling he has conquered you. You are feeling, oh, he has conquered, he wants to move on to the next person. Yeah. So, when you now discover the drama that comes in with sexual connection in relationship, it just helps you to say, Lord, I'm going to stay pure. You don't need it. It is the heart that falls in love, not the body. We have a body chemistry, even if you have body physics or biology, it does not give guarantee to a relationship what helps you is your heart tell your neighbor your heart say that well say your heart say your heart say your heart say your heart another sexual lie is that people say you cannot marry who you have not sampled you know what it means to sample somebody those who, who are samplers never get satisfied with one person. And when you allow somebody to sample you, you become a victim of sampling. And a lot of people cry. You know why some ladies will cry? After five years, after five years, this is what you have been to me. It's not the years, though. 
is the labor she knows she has labored those five years, all the nights, all the nights. So it's not the years, it's a hey, after messing me up like this. I said, no, not five years. Because when you are confident, I saw somebody walk out of a relationship. Can I gist? <laughs> I saw somebody walk out of a relationship and the person walked out of the relationship. Normal. She was okay. The girl was okay. I said, ah, two people leave themselves like this and they're, they're just normal. They say, I'm, I'm not, I don't want to do this. The girl said, okay, it's fine. It's fine. If you feel we can't. So they both, ah, ah. Yeah. And I called them. I said, there are two of you normal before. Why? You just go, you go. He said, yeah, the life goes on now. She'll go, I go. I just I called her, we can't. We can't. She's too she talks to me like she's giving orders. Like she's where are you? Come now. I'm waiting. 9 p.m. She said, I can't take that. See, and E2 is very proud. So pride, made pride. Produce proudness. <laughs> but you know why they were like that? They have not even hugged themselves once. See the eyes they have done say handshake and the head hands and prayed. They've not even had the hug. So I said, You guys have not just said daddy, go and ask her now. She said, I don't. She said, I told God never until I'm married. I was happy. So there was nothing to lose. Under many heartbreak that people are crying. There are some people that can't get over a relationship three years later. I'm still waiting for Paul. Three years. The way they wait for him, people, they don't wait for rapture like that. Tell your neighbor from today. Make a vow in your relationship. Say no to sex. You know, I, I, I stole someone. I said, Don't please, you love this guy. I said, I said, Don't sleep with this boy. So the boy started convincing him, say, hey, 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 leave that thing. Leave that thing. Who know the duam? Forget those who don't talk with it. Leave that thing. And some of you guys are. So he convinced, convinced, ah, convinced, ah, convinced, ah, convinced. I don't know why some people are like, like dummies. A man will just con convince you, convince you. The only thing that you are holding on is, I will marry you. And I've told you, never give somebody something tangible when all he has given you is something abstract. Abstract, I will marry you is abstract. Your body is tangible. If somebody says, I will marry you, can you hold it? It's a promise. Also tell you, okay, when we get married, me and we, let two of us promise ourselves. Because what he promised you is marriage. So you should also promise him. Say, don't worry, when we get married, we will kill ourselves. That's when we get married. So, abstract, abstract. Not I will marry you. Bam. The 21st century lady is very easy to deceive. Just on marriage. The only, not put rage, just put ma. He has proposed. He has proposed. He has proposed. <laughs> Just give them a ring. Ooh, as if they have not been praying for it. It's a lie. Shut up. We had the ring. <laughs> what you have been praying for? You are not pretending like you don't know. They say, cover your eyes. You know he wants to bring ring. Say, put time. Um, I've been praying. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, I told her. She now said, ah. The boy convinced, convinced. As I speak to you now, okay, I've, I've told you a story about somebody who I said left the church and was saying I was a heartless person. That was the lady. She left the church. She was saying I was all kinds of names. She was a student to the poly. I said, called me all kinds of names. What was the problem? The guy convinced her, blah, 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 blah. She got pregnant, had a baby. The guy wasn't interested, wasn't showing care. I, I'm my Peking, what do I do? She's my daughter. I had to start giving money, showing concern. Unhappy, I wasn't happy. I wasn't doing it from my heart. Are you following what I'm talking about? God does not kill an uncheerful giver. He only loves a cheerful giver. But an uncheerful giver, he didn't say he will kill the uncheerful. So I'm free. <laughs> so I was not cheerful. I just give some money, but I was not happy. And I was angry before I give. I was scolded, scolded. And if you know me very well, I can scold you, but I'll still love you. I can shout on you, but I'll still love you. So I told her, I'm not happy, I'm not happy. People condemned her. I said, don't let them, because her I, morals were getting affected. She felt she was useless. She would drop out of school. I said, you, you will graduate, so you're not, in fact, you'll do masters. I said all kinds of things. I was first child. 
the boy came back because now money was coming daddy was bringing money she was looking good again the boy came back part two see sweet talk you are laughing yeah, talk, talk. I don't know why some people are stupid. Talk, 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 talk. Pew. I wasn't seeing her again. You no, know, there are some ladies when they are when they are in a relationship, you know, they will disappear. <laughs> they, will just, they, will, they will leave church. She disappeared. She wasn't talking. And I forgot. People are many, of course. I forgot. I only remember you when I see you. Are you following me? Uh, people are many. I only remember you when I see you. So after I think, but somehow I just the, the spirit of God reminded me. I said, wait, 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 wait. I've not seen. One time I said, where have you been? I said, I'm not angry. I'm just asking where you have been. Daddy, I can't talk to you in public. That's okay. See me on Sunday. I was already going out. Came the next Sunday. My father, please. I said, what? I'm pregnant. Ah! I rick, 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 rick. Get out of my office. Rick, 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 rick. I should at the door. I said, come. <laughs> Came. What happened? God, we punish him. I said, not in my office. Not in my office. He will die. I said, hey, hey, he will not die. He will live. To declare <laughs> she was pregnant what do i do i started again take she gave birth number two this time if you see the way she was committed committed i said how are your children are they afraid of the mother after a while she disappeared again same guy came the third time by my car. I didn't even wait. Are you pregnant? I didn't answer. Yes, I said, I don't want to set my eyes on you again. Ladies and gentlemen, did I do wrong? She went around, she went around town, heartless. That man, wicked, heartless. I said, But tell people why I'm heartless. Many pastors, you do that one the first time, they'll suspend you and forget you. In fact, they will expel you. That's what I said. I said, I don't want to set my eyes on you again. I don't want to ever. Because I now told myself, I partook in this wrong thing. Because I assisted you the first time. You felt, oh, you, are you following me? I started feeling guilty. I said, no. I don't want to set my eyes. You're afraid to come to church, but don't come around for in fact no counseling i'm not talking to you i'm not advising you you want to go to hell straight direct entry go i'm not going to advise you again now what got her cheaply because there has been sex once now the young man is gone two kids they have to take care of them are you following what i'm saying must you die before you learn You have a right relationship, please avoid sexual lies. Put a law on yourself. Praise the Lord. You know, um, you know, another sexual, another sexual lie is um, when people say, when people are saying the fact the person looks good or appears good or has ex nice exteriors means it must be a great girl or a great guy and that's what some ladies do they feel they have good body good shape every man is in trouble your good body your good shape is to glorify God is to prove to the devil now do you know what hurts the devil despite the fact you have features that should make you to sin you are using those features to roll on the ground before God to worship the Almighty Am I talking to somebody here? No. So you like him. Why? He has six pack. Twelve packs. Eighteen packs. Are you not ashamed? Do rich people go to the park? Somebody have twelve packs. Twelve motor packs. Six motor packs. 
you are proud that he has packs. Six pack. Go for brain. When I got engaged, there was no pack. Nothing like pack. It doesn't, what does it take to get pack? Gym. Pack will come. Gym. Three, two, three months, you go get pack. Am I talking to somebody? You feel pains around your tummy, but the pack will appear. But after the pack, you will pay rent. After the pack. <laughs> reality will done on you. You see reality. When your child is hungry, tell your child, say, look at me. Daddy, get out. <laughs> <laughs> Six pack, twelve packs. Amen. Number two. I've started talking now. Hmm? Are you taking notes? I said avoid sexualize, avoid being deceived by sex. Number two, understand the different class of the opposite sex. Understand the types of the opposite sex. Understand the classes of women, the class of men, so you know what suits you. You know, you've got to know what you can't see. Come, President Daniel, that I see this guy. Eh? I see him for the first time, for example. I'm a girl. Is a man and is asking my hand for a relationship. What am I going to think about? You know the right thing to do? For example, you see somebody asking for a relationship. Huh? You know the right thing to do? It's not yes, no. Mm -mm. Don't do that as a lady. You see somebody's asking for a relationship, say let's be friends and see how it goes. But I'm not saying yes, but let's be friends. Are you following me? That time you are friends is to know if he's somebody you can cope with. Because what some people do, say okay, yes, and the mumu boy, you say yes, you say yes, you say yes, come and die. <laughs> let's be, let's say okay, fine, let's be friends. Let's let's just be friends. We we'll see how we we'll see how it goes. That's why you're not seeing anger, you're seeing temper. So. I'm telling you how to preserve your life. Say, I can't, I can't do this. But just say, yeah. when you say yes, you feel committed. Eh? Yes, you feel No, how can you say yes over what you don't know about? And what will help you to see where is when it's sexless. You are not putting that as a premium or a priority. That you cannot look properly. So you must understand that there are different kinds. There are different kinds. There are many young men, you see them. When you get close, you discover that there are many things... That will not make you come close. There are seven kinds of men. There are five kinds of ladies. Six kinds of ladies. Seven kinds of boys. Number one, the player. The player is a smooth guy. He knows the right things to say. Sharp. Every conversation he has a contribution. If you bring issues, he's smart. The player will crack you up. Crack you up. Crack your ribs. The player knows the latest hair. No, the, in fact, the bag you don't know, he knows it. You say, hey, I like my guy, he's in vogue. He's a rogue. <laughs> you, say, okay, at all. you see the player, I can be between five ladies, only him is the man. Some boys are shameless, though. Very shameless. If possible, some boys can stay in guest house there. Very shameless. You see them in the midst, only you, like five girls. Have you seen people like that? I have more female friends than male friends because you are a fool. It is a, it is a, if a lady says she has more male friends than female friends, it's a little bit understandable because ladies hardly trust themselves. That's the truth. But she has nothing immoral with them. But the young man says, I have more female friends. What are you looking for? You can trust a man. Why trust a woman? I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. Why will a man not say, I have more female friends? Why will you have more female friends? Why? They'll see that five girls, only him. And that's how they're knocking your head. See your head. You will laugh. <laughs> the player. 
the pervert. Second kind of men, the pervert. The pervert. As you understand the class of men, so you know what suits you. The pervert sees you. The first thing he says, Wow. Kai. If you have a man like that, 